everyone, welcome back. This is Double O Debbie, and this is episode 11 of Farming Valley. We're up here in my house. I got the roof on. Look at that. Yes. <laughs> it's amazing. I know. It's awesome. Okay. <laughs> so, in today's episode, we're hoping to build the cafe. I haven't really thought about where I wanted to put it, but I know we're going to do it somewhere. Okay, uh, I did <laughs> I did gather quite a bit of wood uh, in between the episodes. I got everything moved over here. Let's see if I can get down here. Uh, so we should have enough wood. Yay! And what did I do with this? stone and enough stone and I've harvested the crops several times and we have 57,000 gold yes oh and uh, we might as well go ahead and sleep so it might be a little bit safer <laughs> outside <laughs> all right is that raining? Yes, it's rained like two or three days in a row. I've been trying to take advantage of it by uh, building, uh, getting the house built, um, working through the night and such, just so I can get some extra work done without having to um, water, <laughs> water as much. Oh. Hello, Mr. Zombie. Hi. Ooh, that seems really loud. There you go. Oh, and I forgot. You lift doesn't open until 9. Bummer. Okay. Guess we can, um... Oh! Oh my goodness! Ah! No! Stay back! Stay back! Creeper's gonna creep. What are you gonna do? I guess we can, uh, gather some sugar cane while we're waiting. Yeah! <laughs> Because I need it so much. Hello, piggy. You were hiding in the sugar cane, huh? Is that zombie scaring you? Is that zombie scaring you, poor piggy? Oh no, all this sugar cane's got to go, piggy. Sorry. You have to find a new place to hide. Awesome. <laughs> I have so much sugar cane now. All right, so let's get, uh, uh, you could be breakfast, Piggy. You might want to find a new place to hide out. <gasps> a baby creeper! Oh my goodness, it's over there. Oh, it looks very explosive-y. See all the sparks coming out of him? And I'm missing. He's so tiny. He's so tiny. There we go. I um, I also added a couple of extra trees because uh, <laughs> yeah, I was chopping them down. It just didn't seem like there was enough, so I added a few more. All right, Ulif, it's time, bud. It's Time. Let's see. We want the cafe. I don't know how big this is. I hope uh, we can get it close by. Let's get it. I think I can. I think I got everything. <gasps> we got everything. Amazing. Okay. Um. What's that? That's a skelly over there. Oh, he's a legendary. Ha ha! 
Hmm. Oh, there's a there's an armored zombie over here. Not the face. Not the face. Well, oh, he's armored. Look at all that armor he's got. He got it no more. Try to think. Where would we? Let's see how big this thing is. Oh wow, that's pretty big. That's pretty big, guys. Hmm. Maybe we could, um... <laughs> oh, so much lavender. I can't, I can't stand lavender anymore. Alright. That should, maybe that'll be good enough. Hmm. Yeah, I like that. Uh, I think that's where I want it. Awesome, you love. Got some work to do, bud. Need to clear a little bit more of this stuff away. I think I have the sound up a little bit too high. Oh, uh, I thought I changed that. Uh, options, controls. Oh, I added the um, overlay, the overlay mod. Here we go. I always like putting that to something other than the R key. Because uh, anytime you try to search for something, uh, if you type in the R, it's going to sort your inventory. I don't know. Sometimes I'm a little weird and I don't like it uh, having my inventory sorted randomly or it's not really random I guess but sometimes I forget it's bound to that key there we go that should be good that should be good there we go you get busy you look okay hmm yeah I think I want the pathway to sort of um, uh, around the pond here. There we go. <laughs> yep. I I did uh I did get all the stuff moved over to the house. Um, I did leave the chest full of lavender <laughs> and I left one there to uh, start a new one because you know why not you can't um, what if what if I've discovered that I need these <laughs> later on <laughs> um, also uh, I was looking at maybe getting into some immersive engineering and we need to buy things from the general store. Oh good, okay, this isn't one of the days they're closed. Uh, in order to get started in immersive engineering, um, you have to, you have to buy the hammer. Uh, two and a half K, oh my goodness. I don't know, uh, I don't know exactly what all we're going to need. But I know we need this hammer. What is this? Uh, engineer's workbench? Hmm. 
in a volt volt meter maybe we'll buy the workbench too just go ahead and do that what is this from Psy? I have no idea what those two <laughs> spell programmers and a CAD assembler. Okie dokie. Oh, there's storage drawers in here. Uh, that could be pretty cool, but you had to buy the upgrades for 500? Oh, the upgrade templates. Oh, and the bee smoker. Uh, that could come in useful to for uh, getting rid of the... Oh, look. Even the timer stopped while we're in the store. That's good to know. <laughs> so while we're in the store, the timer isn't ticking. We could... Because um, you take damage when you're breaking... Um, the beehive even if you're using the scoop uh, so you have to really use um, the bee smoker unless you you want to take a lot of damage and if you have several beehives close together and you try to do them at once you could you could really kill yourself <laughs> uh, so hmm do we really need that? I, I don't think we have any beehives close by, so... Yeah, I think we'll be okay. I think we'll be okay. So, um... Yeah, I don't think, uh... I don't think we need anything else just yet. We, we can't really use this. Uh, except for making dyes, and that's not um, too useful. There we go. Got us a couple of gadgets to play with. Awesome! Ulyph is building our general store. I mean, the, the cafe. I'm going to have to go visit the desert and get some sand and fill in these uh, I don't like all of the the little, I don't know, what are those supposed to be? Cattails or something? Oh yeah, we need to clear a little bit more of this away. There we go. Oh yeah! So, <laughs> we're gonna let him do his thing. Um, it's raining, so I didn't have to water the crops, which is good. That's so good. Oh, we still got, um... Another... Another week's worth of harvest to, uh... To get, to build up some more cash. Um, let's see, it's you look, you look, you look. Oh, yeah, no, it's Saturday. Uh, why, where did you look go? Where are you at, bud? Oh, he's over there building. I can't talk to him. <laughs> I was gonna look at some of the other buildings, but I forgot you can't talk to him while he's working. Such a shame. I should be able to. I should be able to buy stuff from him. <laughs> Go, hey, you know, take a little break. Time for a little break. Okay, there we go. So, I think we have, uh, we don't have to buy the, the Coke oven bricks from a merchant. So we can actually make those ourselves. Um, let's come down here and look. Ah! Um, I think that was... Uh, 
Oh, here it is. Oh, what is that? Sandstone? I guess it's just any type of sandstone, so I am going to have to... Oh, I need to read about it so I can get the dimensions. That, that makes two. So let's get our little handy dandy engineer's manual out here and look at this real quick. Um, Coke oven. There we go. Uh, the Coke oven is the first important machine you will need to create in order to proceed with the immersive engineering. Its functionality is simple. It will heat up coal or blocks of coal without supplying it with oxygen, creating coal coke, a carbon-rich fuel. More importantly, this process creates creosote oil, uh, which is used for a preservative for wood. Uh, yeah, you have to to have the creosote oil to make the treated wood, um, which is going to get us started in creating power uh, by the water mills, <laughs> which is good fun. We can't do the, um, we can't do the windmills because those are going to take hemp and we, we haven't, we haven't bought hemp. You have to buy that from uh, the general store and I haven't done that so maybe uh, next spring we'll do we'll do a crop of of hemp oh uh, okay let's see similarly you can also burn wooden logs into charcoal with this oven albeit with a smaller yield of creosote okay so uh, we need 27 and that makes two, so we're gonna have to make 28. Uh, well, we're, we're gonna get 28, so uh, 14. We need 14 combines, yikes. And sand to stones, gonna, so we need a, a stack of sand. Um, and two stacks of clay and we need to cook one stack of clay so we can go ahead and cook that get that clay cooking up and we can come up here and sleep oh let's put this book away and throw some of this stuff uh, in there oh we had a little bit of stone left Awesome, and some wood. There we go. Got us a little food. That's awesome. Okay, so we can come up here, sleep away the night so we can go get some sand. We don't need much. Um, We need some. Uh, yeah, let's just come out the back way here. Oh, and it's still raining. Yeah. Oh, look at the wheat. It's getting, it's getting big now, guys. All right. Uh, we just need to. Oh no. Oh no. They're mops. What is... Oh, that... Oh, oh, I'm so scared. It's a baby skeleton. Look at the stuff coming off of him. Let's see. Let's shoot him. Oh, I'm blinded. Oh my god. Just from shooting him. Yeah, take that. Okay, my cat decides to just uh, walk right in front of me. What did he get? Oh, 
three blindness arrows. That's cool. Oh, hold on. We're gonna have to let's um, lower the music a little bit more. Maybe put the volume down. It does seem a little bit loud now. All right, let's see if we can get uh, a little bit of sand. Sweet. Um, I really don't know where. Uh, I'm sort of at a loss for how to proceed. I'm guessing the only way for us to automate uh, things is through forestry. Hey, we need that. There we go. Uh, but I don't think we can actually automate the f the farms. The farm farms. <laughs> Just maybe get an automated tree farm, I guess. Which would be cool. Um, That would be pretty nice. Uh, plus, if you want to get into um, uh, bee production, is there? Let's look. No industry. Oh, that kind of makes bees a lot harder. Uh, you don't have gendistry. Um, gendistry just sort of takes out some of the uh, randomness of trying to breed the bees. But I haven't done uh, the bees in a, a long time, so maybe it won't be so bad. <laughs> it's just uh, a little tedious if you do it um, over and over again so plus you, you never know what what has changed it's been um, several minecraft updates since the last time I played with forestry all right that should be plenty I don't know I don't know if I like how <laughs> the the house is uh it kind of looks funky from back here but I didn't know how else to put those together so That's a really nice copacetic music there. Oh wow, we got a lot more than I thought. Uh-huh. Oh, we're going to need some of those arrows. Awesome. Okay. So we just need like 14. There we go. And... I believe that's the right number. Oh, it's still going. Oh, I can't believe that that it was raining again. That is so awesome. Uh, maybe I should... I don't think I've eaten bread in a while. And I had, uh, I had found some barley. I don't know if that's a, a bug. Um, Whenever I found uh, wheat before, if you tried to harvest the wheat, it wouldn't drop anything. And if you got the seeds, it would say you can't plant them. Uh, but... What did I do with all of those seeds? Oh, I put them over here. So like the cotton seeds and the barley seeds don't say they can't be grown like uh, 
they can't be planted like the seeds and the barley I'd found a, a 30 or so barley and you can turn it into flour and then bake it so I got over 30 something bread <laughs> which was nice uh, yeah Uh, we're gonna need 56 of those. I wonder, let's look at this uh, while we're waiting, this engineer's workbench. Hmm. Oh, and I found the cave system under here. When exploring a little bit, it, it doesn't really go anywhere. It was a small cave system with a little bit of iron and charcoal in it. Uh, you know, it pretty much dead ends everywhere without really, you know, going anywhere. And interesting thing is this was, uh, <laughs> this is right underneath, uh, my original farm. So that's kind of cool. All right. How do you get back out of here? Um, I think it's over here. Yeah. Right, chop. So let's check out this workbench. Mm. Let's see, how does this get laid down? Oh, sweet! Oh, what? I have no. <laughs> oh, it looks like um, you put something in here. Uh, I don't know. Maybe there's uh, something in the engineer's thing. Oh, what is the... Awesome. <laughs> it's awesome. Oh, that is cute. Oh, this looks like some... Uh huh. That is weird. I don't know if this is going to... We can probably get, you know, these ore types um, and the gold uh, since those are in the world. The other ores won't spawn, so I don't know if um, if this will actually get those ores. You never know. I guess we... I didn't know they had this in... Uh, Immersive engineering, that's kind of cool. That's kind of awesome. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't help myself. Uh, okay, let's, uh, I'll read some more on this. Um, see what we can do. Okay, it looks like, uh, looks like we have our clay. Sweet. Um, oh, let's do the coke. Oh, here it is. Let's pop that puppy in there and get us some bricks. Sweet. I'll have to find us a spot. I bet we could put uh, we could put our little machines right back here. That would work, right? There we go. That's awesome. Okay. Um, this just said it was a three by three cube, taking twenty seven.
coke bricks. So, and then we whack it with this. Awesome. Now we can uh we can throw uh coal in there to get coal coke, which we have some. We have quite a bit now. Uh we can go ahead and throw that in there cuz I don't have a lot of wood. Uh and this will get us some uh creosote oil to make treated wood with. Um, I'm not sure if you can put glass bottles in there or not. I know we can always do buckets, so maybe um, maybe we'll try. Let's go ahead and drink this water bottle. And it went in there. Um, we'll leave that to it and come back and see if... Uh, Let's make this our miscellaneous uh, chest, so we don't really need that. Maybe we'll store tools and stuff in here too. Oh yeah, got a little bit more cobble there too. Definitely need some more of that. Sweet, it's a snow. I need uh, this one, but I don't need it yet, so. Yeah, so, um, Ulif is, I wonder if he's still making our, uh, cafe, or if he's done. Hear a little slime out there. Let's see if we can sleep and check on Ulif. Um, I guess I'll have to gather some more. Oh, look! It looks like if he's not done, it's really close to being done. I see somebody over there walking. Let's go check it out. We can get a, a few more minutes on the video just to check out the cafe. <gasps> Our crops are done and it's raining again. Yes! <laughs> Uh, man, water just takes so long. So, let's go check out our cafe. Oh, creeper, creeper, no! Bad, oh, skelly! Yeah, there's still some areas that I don't have lit up. Oh yeah, I did, I did install the overlay, and you gotta push F7. Yeah, you can see. Uh, some of my gaps. Oh my goodness, it's a horde of zombies. Bad. Get back. No. No. Oh, and there's an Enderman. Why isn't he, uh... Is he... He's like not melting in the rain. Oh. Oh my goodness. Ah. Ah. There's a creeper. Oh no. Ah. Oh, wrong one. Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> There's a creeper. I'm scared. Oh! <laughs> ah! No! <laughs> Guys, come on! Can we work this out? No! Ah! No, don't blow up! Seriously! Ah! I'm afraid I'm gonna look at the Enderman. Um. <laughs> I just didn't want to accidentally blow something up. Oh, yeah! The sun will come out. <laughs> yes. Okay. Oh! Ah! Baby zombie! Ah! Oh! Ah! Invisible baby zombie! Oh, my goodness. Oh, that's so scary. <laughs> okay, let's, let's get that creeper. You shall not destroy me. Whew. Yes, okay. I think we got some stuff. Oh, I hear another zombie. I really do need to take some time out and... Ah! Oh my goodness. Ah. Oh, it's an elite! Dude! Those elites are tough. My poor sword. There we go. Definitely gonna have to 
spend some time and get some get some more torches put out. Oh, look at it! Oh, it's so awesome! Hey! Hey! Oh, I saw somebody come out. Let's go in where it might be safe. Hi, Granny Catlin. <gasps> Someday I'll make the best blanket you've ever seen. Oh! When... If you want to see what I sell, come back Friday, Monday, and Tuesday between 5 to 1600. That's some... Oh, man. She's got some long hours there. Friday, Monday, and Tuesday. Uh, okay. Okay. Check it out. We got a cafe. Look at all those steaks. That would... Uh, oh, yeah. Um, there are no cows. I forgot all about that. Look at this place. Oh, like, here's Liara serving it, serving it all up. Welcome. A shop. Oh, look, you can get water bottles for nothing. And that's the good water. Awesome. Let's grab a couple of them. <gasps> She's got kitchen things and a recipe book. 25 gold. Let's totally get that. Awesome. I got kitchen stuff, guys. I want a kitchen counter. It's only 250. And a kitchen knife for 50. Baked corn and cookies. Oh my goodness. Pineapple juice and a salad. But those are kind of expensive. Uh, okay, we get a did I buy that? I don't remember. Uh. Okay, no. I only got the book. Alright, so let's buy the kitchen knife and the kitchen counter. <gasps> a fridge! <laughs> this is so cool. <laughs> I'm sorry. An oven. I know we got the money, so let's, let's splurge. Oh, here's a boiled spinach recipe. We don't have spinach. Let's go ahead and buy it, though. I don't know what this mailbox uh, is for. I guess if you're playing on um, multiplayer on a server, you can leave mail and stuff. A lunch box. Let's buy a lunch box, too. Those are cool. Um, there we go. Thank you, Liara. Oh, look at this cool little dining area. That is. Why do you got a spot? Why do you got a spot over here? That's dangerous. Ah! More spots. Carelessness. <laughs> okay, so we got stuff. Um, how do you get down here? Okay, Granny, we'll come and talk to you again. Um, today's Saturday, so we'll have to wait till Monday. Aww. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to slam the door in your face. We're gonna have to make some more torches. Okay. Oh, this stuff is so cool. We'll have a an actual kitchen to put in our house, guys. <laughs> that is awesome. Um, okay, so I will get uh, some of this stuff set up. I'll go to torch there. Uh, mm, I can't put a torch there. There we go. We're gonna have a kitchen. Oh yeah, so <laughs> uh, we'll go ahead and end the episode here. Next time we'll come back and we'll look at some of... Uh, our new little toys. That'll be awesome. We can like set a kitchen up over here, I guess. Uh, or, or over here. I guess that could be sort of the, the entryway and this could be our kitchen over here. Yeah, there we go. Anyway, uh, 
thank you for watching and uh, I hope you come back and see our next episode on um, cooking with Double O Debbie. Thank you for watching and bye bye.